Smith alongside me, Martin Tyler, and a big welcome to you to this match. Paris Saint-Germain today involved in our match against Milan. The home side, well, they're top of their league. Meanwhile, the visitors are placed third in their league. The rain coming down. I hope it won't affect the style of the game we're about to see. This lad, Alan, and we can't let the commentary go without talking about the transfer rumours around him. You can't pick up the newspaper at the moment without seeing his name linked to one of the other clubs, and um, he's just got to concentrate on his game. He's still at this club. Well, he hasn't scored again, and uh, that is an issue, isn't it? Uh, the longer it goes on without a goal... Well, it starts nagging away at the back of your mind. The worst thing he can do is shy away from getting into those goal-scoring chances. Waiting for the action, it's starting now as Paris Saint-Germain get the game underway. Niang. They can bolster their defending, and he takes the shot. Teed up beautifully for the first time shot, but he's missed it. Well, it was begging to be hit, wasn't it? The quality of the pass, the weight of it, perfect. Minis, teammate free in the centre, keeps it going well. And that's the opposition getting back on the ball after a promising attacking situation. Milan are attacking now, and it will go into the middle now. Jelly. Javier Pastore. Minis. Matuidi. Now Mota. That's a real that's a real tussle for the ball there. Here's the York. Abate. Yeah. Good ball. It looked as though they were going to get the ball through. The defender read it. Here's Mota. So how will Milan do here? Obviously, they'll be looking for a win. Need some defensive discipline at the moment. Gialli. Mario Balotelli. Slippery work for the man with the ball past the defender. And the opponents come in strongly. And in comes the header. It's in! The header! Great goal! Just wonder whether he passes this on to other strikers because he gets all the goals. Well, sometimes it's difficult to pass it on, you know, it's just having that sixth sense. And he gave the keeper no chance, Martin, did he? And look at the neck power, the muscles he put into that, really connected with it firmly. Well, that's the first goal of the game, it's 1 0. Wate, he will cover every blade of grass on this pitch. Wateng. It's with De Jong. Tackle here. Good 
great. Oh, and he lets fly here. The service was superb. The shot wasn't. Yeah, there you go. On a plate. But just couldn't take advantage. Abate. Wate. Good pass. He goes for goal. Bender puffing out his cheeks in relief there. He was worried. And Tweedy. Now Motta. He's cut it out. And he's cut out the danger. No mistake about that. And here's a quick counter-attack. was on. But in the end, it came to nothing. Oh, he's going to shoot now. And the chance for Zlatan Ibrahimovic to get his second. And uh, probably an easier chance than the first. Zapata. Nigel de Jong. Thiago Mota. And Tweedy. Here's Mota. That passing is top class. Well, promising the build-up then. But the pass finally cut out. They kept the ball quite nicely, and it's Milan trying to attack now. In steps Maxwell. Lavezzi. Problems for the defenders now, because this forward wants to score. He really does every time they attack. Lavezzi. Great ball. Quick ball. Oh, he's got support here. The attack breaks down. On to Ibrahimovic. Matuidi. Going for the ball. Wateng. Here's the young. We expect Milan to be mighty in these games. They're mighty disappointing at the moment. But there is a half time discussion to come and a second half to try and make this position of uh, losing turn it into a winning hand and the attacker needs a bit of help and he's going to get it now the referee's quite sure it's a goal kick This is Zlatan Ibrahimovic. He's got, he's got room to go on to goal. He's got the goal. Goodness me, it's hit the post. And here it is. And the defender has blocked the cross, and he's done it well. Yeah. Now Motta. Well executed. Balotelli, good ball. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Minez, that's a... Oh. Well, the referee is signaled for half-time, and it's 1-0 here. Well, this is very, very tight, and winning the ball and keeping it is two different things, really. That's why we've got an even share of possession. Yeah, they have uh, both had plenty of the ball, but uh, you'd like to see a better end product from both sides in many ways.
time is ticking away, it's time for a change, and here it comes. <laughs> 45 minutes still to go, the second half underway. Player came in strongly, the defender. Here's Mota. Now the counter-attack could be on here. Alex. Levetsi. It's with De Jong. Mario Balotelli. They're passing it well here. Back it goes. Here is Ibrahimovic. Attacking play from Milan. That's a great ball. Challenge. That's really well done. Good defending. And Tweedy. His teammates are around him. They've linked up well. That was an opportunity. Decent piece of defending when the danger was mounting. Diago Mata. Home team about to make a change. Platic. Milan are attacking now. And it's Ibrahimovic. Benes! So dangerous. Seen the chance. Pass doesn't get through because the defender actually recognized the direction it was coming in quickly. Paris Saint Germain back in possession now. It is. That would be a Paris Saint Germain free kick. This is a key moment for the manager. He knows he's got the lead, and he's now going to do his best to try and retain that. Free kick coming up quickly. And he's tried his shot from long range. Keeps it going well. Now Motta. Well, it was a good prospect there for the attacking team, but the ball winners got it back for them. A couple of options available. Brilliant pass there. It's just gone wrong for him at the vital moment. Lunging in, slide tackle. It's Robinho. Well, they're in a good position here. Mario Balotelli. It's a good pass. Possession with Milan. your screen now the comparison between the two teams in terms of possession of the ball he needed to be quick there urgent work from him and he's uh, kept them out really on his own Menez and the team relying on its defenders to keep out this uh, dangerous looking attack oh can he get it away here he's going to cross it Bravely in for the header. Well, we could get some news on the injury. I think Jeff Shrees is on the case. He went over at his ankle, but he's a game player, so I don't think that will take him off. Well, thanks for that news, Jeff. Well, there's no doubt about this one. He won't be able to continue. They'll need to get the substitute ready straight away. Yeah, sometimes you know, don't you? And he looked serious straight away when he went to the ground.
And it's an injury they're not going to be able to cure, so Milan are going to make a substitution. such a good position given his aerial ability well when he gets in those positions normally you can say good night but uh, a fair miss for him Mancini keeps it going here's the cross very poor from the crosser really well in for Paris Saint-Germain be a good idea just to get a fresh player on and cement their position as they look to hold on to this lead. Diago Mota. Strong play by Paris Saint-Germain to win the ball back. Football is wonderful when it's being exhibited like this. Super passing and the... Uh, he shoots! A timely challenge. Something could be on here. Great chance. It's behind the corner on the front foot again. The team that's leading by a goal. And they've been trying with a fair amount of shooting here. Well, it wasn't textbook stuff, but he did the job. The defender just about. It's a slide tackle. Good ball. Good skill. You look at the defender, not good enough. Jelly. We've got to clear it now. It's a memorable day for the opposition, but a miserable one for Milan, as they now are surely the side that's going to lose this match. Zapata. Mancini. Time ticking on. And the attack not really ticking. And the shot's off. Poor lad feels sorry for him, really, because at this time he should have done a lot better. He should have. I've been in that situation. You have to feel for him. Great opportunity. Not to be. A terrific reaction. And he strikes a goal. And in the nick of time, the equaliser. What a game this is. It's taken another twist with Milan's equaliser. Well, you just can't call it, can you? What a response. Oh, the momentum is with them now, isn't it? Having come from behind, this could be a famous win if they can grab another. Back at level pegging again at 1-1. Alex, well, it's still level. And there is the final whistle after 90 minutes.